Alright everybody, hope you enjoyed this time-lapse video for day 8 of Timeless Week Mark 2. Uh, so for this time-lapse, I made a painting for a YouTuber known as PewDiePie. Uh, so pretty cool. Um, so this painting actually was requested by a viewer, and that, uh, that was by Shelby, so that is much appreciated. Uh, so yeah, if any of you, out there, if any of you guys would like to uh, request something for a time-lapse or tutorial, let me know down in the comments below. That would be, uh, be much appreciated to see what you guys come up with. I always like to see what you guys can come up with. Uh, so yeah, it's pretty cool. I have a lot of requests actually right now that I've gotten uh, on, a lot, on a few of my videos, so that's pretty cool. Just trying to work my way through them. Uh, so we'll get there. I'm going to be doing a lot of them for time next week and the few days coming up uh, that are left in this week, so pretty cool. Um, so yeah, so th uh, this is pretty cool. So I guess you could call this uh, painting right here a uh, custom request, uh, because Shelby sent me an image uh, uh, that she went, or he, sorry, I'm really sorry if I get that wrong. Um, but they sent me an image, uh, of, uh, something they want me to do for PewDiePie, and that would be this one right here, which I think turned out pretty cool. Uh, I did my best to get it as detailed as I could to match the actual image, uh, but there's some stuff I just couldn't, uh, do or replicate on duct tape, which, uh, kind of stinks, because, like, this image had a lot of shading in it, because this is kind of like a lantern or torch kind of thing, uh, so it was illuminating the floor and, uh, sending different light shadows over different places, uh, so I didn't really, I couldn't really replicate that. I did the best I could to make it look like that's, like, it's kind of shaded out some places. Uh, like right here for the flooring, uh, I kind of made it rounded off here and then go straight into this piece here. Um, so it kind of looks like it's, something's illuminating this part of the floor, but the rest is black and so is the top, which I think looks pretty cool. Um, it doesn't really match, it doesn't really show too much of, like, a light source coming from anywhere, but I did the best I could with it. Um, and then right here we got just the two barrels, which I believe there's a reference to the barrels in PewDiePie or something from one of his videos, but I really, I don't really watch the video, so I'm not sure what that reference, what that reference is from. Uh, but if you, if any of you guys are fans of, uh, PewDiePie, let me know if you guys know what the reference is or the joke or whatever you want to call it behind the barrels and him on this. Uh, so that'd be much appreciated, kind of curious about that. Um, so yeah, uh, I do have a lot of, I did use a lot of pen on this to give, uh, PewDiePie some details, so like his hair, uh, his face, his shirt and everything, uh, that has a lot, of, I put a lot of pen onto that to make it match the image, so I'm gonna try and see if I can get a decent angle here, uh, there we go, I think you guys can see the pen lines onto the painting, uh, I gotta try and find the right angle because whenever I put the, the image like this right here, if I can, Actually, yeah, right there it's starting to white out, as you can see, you can't really see much on the shirt and everything. If you put it at different angles, it just whites out and there's a lot of black uh, in front of it, which is really annoying. But I think I can find the right angle right here, so there we go. So you can just see right there on the uh, shirt, there's a lot of lines and everything with pen. Uh, that give it a little bit more detail, make it look like, like, the look like it's kind of wrinkled, uh, so that's pretty cool. And then right there on the face you can see there's like a bunch of pen marks right around his mouth, which kind of, uh, it's kind of like shadow or stubble or something, uh, which is actually on the image, so pretty cool. Try to get this as detailed as I could. Um, so you can see kind of like the uh, the image kind of breaks up there in his hair, it kind of looks like earphones, which is right there, headphones. Uh, so yeah, I did the best I could to get this uh, detailed or to make it look like the actual image. Uh, so yeah, I do hope you guys all enjoyed this video. And if you did, please hit that like button, would, that would be much appreciated. Um, I really, uh, really do appreciate the support when I see the likes and everything. Uh, and if you guys are new to the channel and you uh, checked out some of my other videos and you're just watching uh, some others that you've seen uh, and you like what you see, uh, hit that subscribe button if you'd like. That'd be much appreciated. Always welcome new subscribers to the channel. Uh, so yeah, that's pretty much going to wrap up this video here. Uh, so yeah, once again, hope you enjoyed. So thanks for watching. And also thanks to Shelby for this request once again. And yeah, so as always, just enjoy the one of those duct tape.